over and it's been a long and tiring three days. And it's really late at night right now and we're really tired, but we got so many questions we want to try to answer as many more as we can. So rapid fire style. And go. Devin asks, does Retro have a booth presence at E3? No. Uh, Carlos asks, what happened to Project Giant, Robot Giant, Guard, and Devil's Third? No clue. Do you, uh, Kevin asks, do you think this will be the last E3 for the Wii U? Probably not. Jay Aponte asks, <laughs> not even a sliver of Devil's Third's info? Nope. And Mike asks, is Mario Maker going to ship with any levels or pro design levels section that is regularly updated? Probably. Shy Guy asks, is Devil's Third at the show? Still no. <laughs> Tyler asks, is any word on the overworld for the tr uh, for Triforce Heroes? Not yet. Uh, E-Gamer e -gamer asks, what could possibly be cuter than an Isabella Mimo? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Krishanata asks, any sign of Rhythm Time 3DS on the show floor of it being translated for any audiences? Any sign of Ace Attorney game set in the past with Sherlock Holmes or reports of it coming over? No and nope. Uh, Mike Michael A. Zulk asks, I would like you to find out when Yoshi's Woolly World will release when you are at E3 next week. October 16th. Sorry we didn't answer that sooner. <laughs> uh, and Evil Mario asks, will there be a world map maker element in the Super Mario Maker? No idea. Uh, Tremagus asks, why did Nintendo focus so much on spin-offs? Because the fans buy them. Chris asks, also what's the deal with the new Animal Crossing game or is it even Animal Crossing? Amiibo Festival? It is Animal Crossing. It's a spin-off. <laughs> And that's all we've got. That's what we got. Thank you so much for sending in the questions, and we'll definitely answer any other things you got for us. So just keep tweeting, and somebody will hopefully find it and answer. <laughs> Yay! Good night. Good night. We're going to go sleep yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs>